love has taken me to dark places. But Los Angeles has got to be as dark as it gets. So, you have a girlfriend yet? Holy shit. Yeah, like how old are you? Like 14? 15. Basically 16, so. So Delilah, she's not a hooker. That's what you're thinking, right? Is an Avrin. Come for the spring lettuce mix. Stay for the perfect life that could be yours if you just spend enough and quit gluten, you fucking asshole. Yeah. Perfect. Let's get you an apron. A new apron? Joy. Hello. You? No. Fuck. No, I'm not doing that. I'm not going to try to figure out who you are, why you look so concerned about the state of that heirloom tomato. Do you think this peach looks like a butt? There is no wrong answer. No. Not biting. Yeah. How can I help? How can you help? Yeah. Um, can you tell me if this Carl Young book is vegan? Does everyone in LA walk around like they own the place? Will, kismet, right? I mean, what are the chances? Don't take this the wrong way, Will. Please be not this boring on your Instagram. Okay? I will try my best. My secretary will bow you. I'm an idiot. Am I sunburned through this t-shirt? How is that a thing? I'm sick. You're a rookie with a sunburn is what you are. Calvin told me at the store. Let me in. Is that 99 cent ramen? Yeah. Blow. Ellie. God, it's from the Big Lebowski. It's going on your list. Honestly, he seemed a little creepy. What can I say, friend? I have creepy taste in friends. Ew. No. Too soon, too much, too good. Yeah, I just wanted to stop thinking about it and just do it. And besides, I woke up with a completely brilliant idea. What's the idea? Movies. On loop. In, in the bookstore. Oh, no. Movie this is Jasper? He looks like a manager at a comic book store. So, this is the Love Squad. Teeth achingly, hippy dippy, unaware of a glaring privilege driving their so called conscious choices. Just give me the idiot's guide, okay? Being famous don't make you magic. Cover shit in gold, it's just super shiny shit. <laughs> I had a feeling you might know that, but I was wrong, and now I pity you. About the 50 grand. The 50 grand? Would you settle for that blowjob? <gasps> Well, this is a first for me. <laughs> I see that. I assume you realize that you need psychiatric help? I want to make your cake. No, <laughs> no way, no. no, that's too much. Can I get a different sign? Loves buns, am I right? Well, that's accidentally horrifying. What, you're gonna let her through? Was she 13? No, no, the lady friend's a baker. <laughs> what? Stop playing games and just wipe her already. Hey, and while you're at it, Take her name and give mine back to me. So go ahead. Poor bastard didn't even get an invite. So much for unnoticed. But it's not gonna work because, hello, it's past life trauma, <laughs> always. Shit, that wasn't a joke. Say something, say something, anything. I shouldn't. <sighs> this is crazy. I am crazy. Okay? Well, yeah, yeah. Sure? You seem kind of distant. <laughs> I'm sorry, are we that kind of fuck bunny now? You know, Lovey said something about all of us going to the beach later oh, today. Right. Sooner than I'd care to, but great. How's book one? Margarita just rescued the rape victim from eternal damnation. So, uh, you know, light beach reading. I didn't realize that, I'm sorry. I appreciate that, but it still feels weird. Like you were trying to get him out of town so that you wouldn't have to deal with him. Being attracted to very smart women is a double-edged sword. We could have a signal, like. What is that, are you, are you Spider-Man? <laughs> oh my God. So glad you guys are here. Oh my God. <laughs> All right. uh, you related to Bruno? Ray's a not so secret fantasy fan. He's referring to Bruno Bettelheim, author of The Uses of Enchantment is a classic. 
No relation. I'm just a fan. It's good to meet you, Mr. Quinn. Call me Ray. Well, great name. Almost sounds made up. <laughs> Is she trying to spar with me? <laughs> That's funny. I was just thinking Amy Adam. How totally ungoogleable. Young. Are you still young? Tell that to my vagina. No one warns you. You wake up one day drier than the Sahara. Is this gonna work? Because my car is really old. Yeah, that shiny new Prius was all yours. All you need is a group hug and 39K. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking crackheads. <laughs> I heard they found his body in a sex dungeon. Come on, Gabe. Don't kink shame the dead. No, I was not, okay? But I loved him. The thing is, people take advantage of people with money. That's just a fact, okay? I'm not going to apologize for protecting my family. Ever! Privilege check, aisle one. <laughs> Salmonella? <laughs> as Raymond Chandler said, there is no trap so deadly as the trap you set for yourself. Maybe I'll stick around for a while. Push my luck. One thing's for sure. You can't beat the donuts. No, this is good for me. And I don't need you coming in on behalf of Will or Joe or whatever the fuck his name is, trying to make me feel some type of way about it, okay? Can you scrounge up some more quarters? We need three more. Fine. But if I come back and witness anything nasty, I'm running away forever. What are your favorite books? Total honesty, I'm not the biggest reader. I just really want to date a guy who is. I want you to be my girlfriend, love. <clears throat> Sorry. Just a little dry. Answer honestly, because your psycho friend Gabe is a human lie detector. What's the longest narrative film shoot in history? Boyhood, 12 years. Not even close. The Thief and the Cobbler, 29 years. Doesn't count, it's not live action. Not what I asked. Okay. <laughs> okay. What is happening here? Are you... <laughs> oh my like, you were purposely trying to have no personality whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ow. In Reno Veritas. Hey, you asked for it. Be a big man. Hope she takes you back. Yeah, we're all a bunch of assholes. Mm. Do, do you even hear yourself? Dimitri, don't give a fuck, bro. In BT Dubs, he confiscated all your shit, so you might as well just settle in. I gotta get out of here. Oh, great. Well, let's tell Dimitri we're making a change of 40. So, wait, stop! What? What? Okay, you gotta remember the part where you were ranting about how the peaches were mad at you. <laughs> You're kidding, right? I thought he never left the hotel. You don't remember him trying to get one of us to shove a gray goose infused tampon up his ass so he could keep his high at a cr If I was your agent, I would be sucking your dick right now. That's quite an endorsement. Well, somebody woke up on the wrong side of an ass a trip. Okay. I was high. Yeah, I hate when I slide into a girl's vagina without meaning to. Sorry, it's very hard to think clearly in the river of crazy you're spewing. Okay, get a grip. She's in danger. You were back on the hard stuff. I'm sober, you asshole. Okay, this is a sacred day, and your drama is not going to get in the way. I cannot deal with it. No.